Well, one is a bridge Wheeling natives are used to crossing almost every day. The other is a bridge about to become reality after decades of discussion. 7 News reporter Colin Roos has an update on the Fort Henry and Wellsburg projects that have kept the Division of Highways busy. He joins us live in the studio now. Colin. Catherine, the DOH District 6 tells me commuters should have two early Christmas presents. Both the work on the Fort Henry Bridge and the grand opening of the Wellsburg Bridge are scheduled for completion by the end of the year. We've all been able to see the repainting job on the Fort Henry Bridge for a while, but what other work is being done there? Engineer Tony Clark tells me it's similar to what crews are doing on the rest of I-70. Steel and concrete repairs that are necessary, but aren't obvious if you're driving over it. Meanwhile, the Wellsburg Bridge is still on track to be done in mid-November, in time for those Thanksgiving family trips. Even when we broke ground, people were talking about how, uh, how exciting it was going to be when it's finished, and it's just... I mean, it's not taking any longer than we expected it to, but it's still, it's a big project. It's taken lots of time. Clark says the concrete decks are being poured on the West Virginia side, while on the Ohio side, they're building the foundation over State Route 7. It's part of the work to let cars access the span that's already in place along the river. Now, as far as future projects go, Clark says to expect some traffic headaches for a few more months on I-70 near the PA state line. They have a hard deadline to get those bridges complete, also in November. Live in the 7 News studio, I'm Colin Roos, working for you.